saw the flea, this parasitical species, have given me access to this computer that can cross-reference anything I put into it with their entire database. Aha! I'm gonna do this golden egg fragment because apparently that's where this grand maw, head of the flea, spawned from. Is that all I can do with it? Hmm. Huh. It's a bit useless. Right, what are we going to have to use this for? But it is going to be one specific item that we have to put in and something is going to glow from it. See that we're not getting any, any information from any of these items. Ah this, I want to know what this is, the simulacrum. Nothing. Right, let's just, we're not going to be able to do anything with this are we? Ah! Oh, the little bot! What did I just get? The bot has been repaired? Oh, nice! Is, it, is, that, is that the bot? Oh my god, I've got a bot! I've repaired the bot! I'm so glad I didn't sell that bot! I, 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 now it, I was kind of having thoughts whether it was useful or if it was strictly just a form of currency. But it can repair things. Okay. <laughs> Let's go and see what Don's got to say about the, the bot being repaired, but I'm just going to have a quick explore. Oh, this is some science fiction shit right here. Oh, it is. Is that a ghost? A muscular flare sentry? Power generators? Oh, that's nifty, that device. Fix the robot. Hey, Don, I fixed the robot. There it is, is that? A... Does it come with us or what? Yeah, it does, look. Buddy, you actually here. Yeah. You, you did this for me. I did. He could be helpful. He meant so much to you. He helped you a lot and means so much to you. Thank you, Mark. This is amazing. Thank you. Who's a good boy, hey, buddy? You are. <laughs> yeah. Me and Don, man. Brothers. We're like that. We're like this. Okay, so. What's the score? What's the cracker lacking? Right, we need to go to Witherburg. Because I'm sure I've got a hunch on who's part of this flea. And he's in the bar there. He's a schizophrenic and he was having issues the last time we spoke to him. Back to the warden. Repaired, buddy. All we've got to do is got to get inside of the the bar and head down down here somewhere. I always forget what this place is actually called. The Abbey. That's what it is.
See this guy. See, look, I can't talk to him. I knew it was him. He was one of the first people I spoke to when this when I started. Hey, good looking. <clears throat> can I can I buy you a drink? Oh no, can you buy me a drink? <laughs> I'll, I'll you know, Atum, the Grand Bar sent me. What the f what the fuck? We don't have much time. This host has regained control. Your host is rejecting you. The host is rejecting you. How is that possible? The host must obey the bristle worm. This is ordained by the Grand Maw itself. What happened? I have grown weak since I left home. I pushed this host too far. The mobility suit has sustained our journey on foot. His muscles have withered. His feet are bloody. His skin is raw. We traveled too far. We visited the ruins of Tukan. Saw the piles of bones at Aklan Mountain. Even now. Most fights me. Good. Alcohol diminishes his ability ah. to resist. I brought him to this tavern and kept him intoxicated. This is the only way I can stay alive. I was so close to finishing this assignment, to discovering a cure. How are you going to finish your quest? Do you know how to cure the foul brood? Yes. The Grand Moor requires the boss weapon. We can use it to destroy the Mongol slingshot. The slingshot is old technology. Its vibrations are the source of the foul brood. The road to pass is dangerous and very long. The warden in Kirin has been disconnected, but I have found a way to Add it back to the network. I have found a nexus. Hmm, I've got a nexus. What's a nexus? What's a nexus? What does it have to do with the wardens? A nexus controls the entry and exit points of a warden. Using a warden, you will be able to instantly travel to the boss homeland in Kirin. I have both the location and the coordinates of the nexus. The hanging nexus is, is in Zozo. He is taking back control. The coordinates are at one. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm gonna be sick. Ooh, why are you looking? <laughs> hmm. Right, so I've got the hanging nexus from this guy. I thought, you know what I thought I was gonna be able to do? I thought I was gonna be able to use this. On him to take the, the, the worm out of his head. Okay, so we've got a new place to go, and I think that's, to be honest, I think that's where we're going to go. Zozo. Didn't mean to do that. Mm -mm. Uh-uh, what? We you talking about? Uh-uh. Leave the building when I tell you to, son. Oh, there's so many places to go. Right. Right, 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 right. Do you know what I'm going to do? I want to go to the tear and the old arc first because these are new. 
the tier. A real estate tour, beat it with all dark ones, new. Yeah. Let's see what's at the tier. Ah. I have to drop something in there. Right, by the looks of things. Let's go to the old arc. Because I can't imagine that will be. Like, this these will be, be nice big. Yeah, it would. I can't imagine these will be big areas, but I might find some items that could be useful to me later on. That seems to be how the the, the general. Why? The general gameplay of the game works is you need to go to places, find like an item there, and it'll help you in the future. So, why does she not want to be here? Because it... I think I stepped in something. Be a big dinosaur shit. Oh, what's this? Oh, we've got a portal spawner. That looks like a gun. Is this the portal gun? Awesome. Happy days. Okay then. What was that girl's name in school? The one on the hockey team? Jennifer. Yeah. Marita Meyer. Marita Meyer. Marita. Meyer's sisters. I always liked her. She would share her sommies with me when mom didn't make lunch. When did that happen? When did mom ever skip on making lunch? Well, never, but Marita didn't know that. <laughs> I got to share lunch with a pretty girl and eat a bit extra. Charlize is at nursing school with Marita. She went to work at Baraguanat Hospital. I can imagine those two being friends. They both loved animals. I thought you would become a vet. A vet. They both wanted to help people. Yeah, they both wanted to help people. Charlie's patched me up a few times, eh? She was a good person. Always nice to me. That's why she was in the car that night. I'm just going to say she loved you. That's going to probably bring up harsh memories. Ah, she was. And she loved you, Don. She really did. I loved her, Marky. I miss her. We've still got a lot of ground to cover. Let's go. Poor bloke. Okay then. We're going to that new place. Which was where? Zozo. We're going to try and get to the bottom of this. This worm situation. I need to get into the, the mongrel's base. So I wonder if these are two new two places that we don't have access to. The hanging nexus. There we go. That's where we're going. So if, from what I grasp. From what I've been told is that this is the start of a warden the start gate and we need to access the finishing gate which he said was mongrels that's what it was like mong 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 maybe it's inside of the mongrels place oh this is nice Wait up, my China. The hanging nexus. Oh no, that was only one way across the bridge. Come on, the bridge is safe. Hi. <laughs> but how many times is it going to be safe before it does collapse? What is that? Looks like yeah. Looks like one of them 
metal orbs you put people in so they can go to the bottom of the ocean. Like old school ones. Reclaimed nature that I can go there if I want to. Can I go through this pipe? I can. Aha! Oh, what's that? There's, there's something big kicking off here, you know. It's still active. Local warden network. Nexus system is offline. Guardians not respond. Enable it. An alien looking structure of black metal suspended by ropes and vines. Right, so the local warden network is online, but the Nexus system is offline. Now the thing is, I, I have got a Nexus. See, I've got a Nexus, but I don't know where to use it. Maybe I use it here. Right, let's figure out what to do with it. Don't get too close to the edge. That's probably good advice. That's probably the best advice. Don't kill yourself. Oh look, I can talk to it. Oh look what we've got. We've got a robot. Don't like heights, Marky. Yeah, that's a long way down. Hello, friend. Don't know who the Mupani are. What's the last thing you remember? Must have been a while since you were last activated. What's the last thing you remember? The only one, the builders. They started up the warp network. I waited for them to return to me. I waited through the rain and fire and the storms of dust that shred metal from my very home. And when I could wait no longer, I descended into darkness. Now oh, I've heard some speak about the Mupani. Who are they? They were creators. They were the wardens. They were the peaceful and benevolent. If we are no longer here, then this world is an emptier place. I will warn them. They deserve better than to vanish. But it seems that their work goes on. And you, human, what do you want with me? I need access to the warden network. You humans are all the same. You create without a thought. You destroy without a warrant. You expect those you leave behind to forget what you have done to them. I witness what you have kind to the enemies. How you program them to slaughter and hate their own brethren. Oh shit. That's pretty harsh. So this, this Nexus Garden seen some shit. It wasn't me though. It wasn't me. It wasn't us. You see that. Yet you want my solitude. I'm only asking for your help. Not servitude, no. I'm asking for your help. What is that that you want? I need to access the city of Vars. I know there's a warden there, but it isn't accessible anymore. My second processor is damaged. Without it, I cannot access the warden network. It is combining technology, specific to warden guardians. Without one, the warden network remains locked off. I'm sorry you came all this way for nothing. But it just so happens that, it just so happens that, I found this CPU. Now where did I find this CPU? I found this CPU in, in one single place that there was nothing else there but a, an old petrol station. And I found this in the back of it and there was nothing else there. If I remember correctly, I don't know what the name of the place was called though. Boom, bada bing, bada boom. I found another guardian. Oh, so that's where I picked it up from. I found another guardian. I found another guardian. 
It, uh, it wasn't using its processor. What does that mean? What does that mean? Can you add bass onto the network? Okay, where can I find those coordinates? Do you think I want to go back? Have to go back to the the guy we just spoke to. Where could I find those coordinates? Yes, I do not know. Okay. Yeah, what's the guy's name again? Bop, 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 him. Atom. I've probably got to go back to Atom to get the coordinates of, of Bath, and by this time, the little tentacle thing in his head probably would have fed him more alcohol so it'll be able to talk to us but I am going to explore here reclaim nature yeah I think it is definitely best to be thorough in this game because imagine if you can you just imagine if I, I'd missed going to that petrol station before and not picked up that CPU like I would have gotten here and just been like well why the fuck do I have to go you know what I mean that, that's I think probably one of my biggest gripes with the game is you've got to be thorough in your ex recently. thorough in your explana exploration something pissed on it did it hopefully it's not big hmm just yesterday oh this was a city hello. Oh, nice, some more gold, baby. A what is it? A cake tree. Sunlight filters through the cake as delicate leaves. But is there anything useful? You know what this rock reminds me of? A craggy rock just from the foliage, like a bare bone from dead pelt. Bill and Ted's excellent adventure. When the... Oh no, it's Bill and Ted's bogus journey. When the the robot usses march Bill and Ted up here and throw them off the edge. What a what those movies are so good, Bill and Ted. Bill and Ted's excellent adventure and Bill and Ted's bogus journey, highly recommend them to anyone. It's got Keanu Reeves in as well, so you know it's top tier. Mist rises from the dead city below. Yeah. It was once abundant with life. And now there is only death. What is this? Looks like a bath. But it isn't in fact Fackle. Right, tell you what, let's... Where am I going? I'm going back to Witherberg. Have a chat with... Atom. If Adam doesn't speak to us, I'm lost. I don't know what to do. I want to know what I have to drop into the tear. No doubt I've already been told, but I've, <laughs> I've been told so much in this game. It's just a case of remembering it all. And it's a, it's a lot to take in, son. No. Oh, is he dead? Oh, he's dead. 
Is he dead? Oh, he's fucked like. Right, we've got big we've got big lads, we've got big big problems. Hmm. I wonder if this late I don't think that lady can help us. Well Hmm. I think we're gonna have to go back to the flay. Cause we need the quarters to pass. Now the thing is, can because they're a hive mind, but then again they're only a only a hive mind between the host and the parasite. Maybe the, the quarters of bass are long long gone. I should have asked for them when I spoke to him. Fuck, he's dead isn't he? Okay. Who would know? The, the flail definitely want to help me because the cure for them is in bass so they're going to have to give me the coordinates. Scoria? No, I don't want to be at the Scoria, I want to be at the house. Shawnall House, no, the Scoria is where I want to be. Yeah, there could be big issues here if this, if this guy can't help. Please help. No. It's got no information on that. Only thing I might think is that I've got to come and use this that, that token for the games. Shit. Who's gonna know about coordinates? To bass. I could ask for help from the Hanzai. Or the Hanasi or whatever they're called. Right, 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 right. Mongrel, Array Site, Flay, Warden. Cacus, Kettle Garage, Kettle, Hanasi, so there's nothing new there. I beat the old orc, that's where I found that gun. What about the Agnet outpost? Because we went there and we couldn't have, we didn't have access to it. I wonder if I've got access to it now, have I activated something that gave me it? Hold on. Before Atom died, he did say Mongrel. He was blatantly trying to say Mongrel, do you know what I want to go back to the Mongrel base?
let's just have a look. I'm gonna have a look. See what's a crocodile, even though I haven't got a worm, he's not gonna let us in. See, we can speak to him. Give. Oh no, it's give. I can't give him anything. Because I ain't fucking got it, mate. Shit the bed. Right, tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have to go. Back. I'm gonna have to go back to the... But was what's the bulwark again? Oh, where? I forgot where the the I, f I forgot where the the arena is where we have to use the token. Fuck, who is it? Yeah, where is the? Knowledge slave. See, if we do go to there, we can get access to this place. But where's this place? Commandant Dirk. Is it the bulwark? Yes, it is. It is the bulwark. My memory served me well. Right, come on, we're gonna have a gun of this. I've only got to do one battle, and I get access to up the top of these stairs. We've got a we've got a coin, so let's let's do it. Hey, it's, it's taken us a while before. We, we thought we were going to do this ages ago, right? I want to save it in case I fuck it up. Okay, so where do I use the token again? Here. The arcade. Right then. Boom. This is the Hanasi token. Let's fight in mortal combat. Shit, he's had his tongue cut off. Right. 
to engage in conversation with you uh, uh, on the set of details that we have to talk like song. I I have no voice. I feel really bad because that is the in one hundred percent the consequences of my actions. Because I asked him about topic three, and he told me that his his tongue was going to get cut off. Right, so we're going to have to figure this out ourselves. He probably would have told us what we had to do, but now I don't know. Why are you? Talk to Don. Don. Looks like this is more up your alley. So it's like an arcade game. Looks like it. <laughs> it's as simple as that. Mm, looks like it. I know you always love the arcade. Yeah, the one in Hilbra still has my high scores. Well, not anymore, I suppose. But I don't know, eh? This looks more complicated. There's a lot at stake here. You can do this. You got this, homie. I know. But I also know you can do this. Yeah, but you're right, eh? Let's do this. I'm sure I've still got what it takes. Nice. So we can lose this because look, a save game got created, so... Am I going to be in control? Go on, Don, son. A new challenger awaits. But I won't get to choose again until I defeat him. Select at least three combatants with a maximum of nine. Okay, so they've got a spring buck, which is an agnate. They've got a flea. They've got a Hanasi giant scorpion. And the person I'm fighting is the Priest of Tribulation. So he's got one health, and I imagine that's 10 armor or damage. He's pretty powerful. Okay, right. Right, I get that. So, yeah, I just need someone that's got more life. Look, we've got loads of Hanasi. Ten life and four damage, I imagine. I think, I don't know. Okay, so the middle one, I want someone that's... Oh, so I can have as many as I want. Okay. Six and nine, that's pretty balanced. I've got no idea what I'm doing here, like. Right, we'll go with six and two, I don't like that. Five and eight. I'm gonna go with that one first. Oh, wrong button. Really, I want people with lots of health. Only two combatants of the same type may enter the free. So why do I not just add loads? Oh, because it's the die. Fuck, I just... 
Oh, because you can add three. Okay, right, wait there. Let's just add. So that's it, eight. We've got eight combat, and so I think I'll have that one, that one, and that one. And we'll just engage in combat. One, two, three. They're not having this in combat. Just them three. Right, let's go. Gentle touch, love and stroke, cleanse fire. Two to four damage, three to five damage. I'm gonna go with this. He's got six health, he's only got one, he's got ten health. I'm gonna smash him with it. Nice. Oh shit. Putting in work that cunt like. So he one more hit and I'll get him. I can't use cleansing fire, why? This is a guaranteed kill. You did, homie. Oh no, it's not. Oh, because it has to go through the armor. Now he's only got... Yeah, that was armor. Now he's got 8 health, okay. Fair enough. Ah, because look, this does loads of damage. This Hanasi. Nice. How much damage did it do? Three. Five damage. Right, I can't use anything. Shit. I've used everything. Oh, I need to wait till my points regen. Right, end turn. Oh, did he block it? I blocked it? Go on, son. Three to six. That only takes two points. That takes three. You know what it is? I like these. This is probably the best person you can use. Kill him, go on. Oh, you blocked it, you cocksucker. I'm gonna just end my turn. I want me points back. <laughs> what the hell, this middle one's taking damage like. Kill this bastard, I'm sick of his shit. One to three damage. He's only got one health, so let's just use whatever we've got. That's the lowest damage possible. This. You did, homie. Suck it to me, son. No. Oh, she's dead. Nightmare. But it doesn't matter because I've got my big damage dealer. Right, so he's got t he's got 11, 6, 7, that's got 8. Let's take this one down. It's got the, to the least health and armor. Did I miss? It fucking dodged. It dodged. You, you cocksucker. Only done one damage, no one cares. 
Ah, uh, is that the hit ratio? 89%. Got his four damage, that was big damage there, like. It's only got four health. I'll get it next time. Fuck you, son. Oh, it only done. It's only got one health. Oh, it's my turn again. Right, let's get something that's low. That's only going to cost me two. And it's dead. Yeah! Taste my blade. He's got laser beams. Oh, you got two shots? How the fuck does he get two turns, like? Kill him. Three damage, I'll accept that. I'm actually gonna... Use this, three to five. Love and stroke. Four damage, it did big damage there. I don't think you've got this one, mate. I know you're chatting shit to us, but you, you... You're already dead. I'm using this. Did it. Bang, big damage. Ha ha ha, suck my balls. Oh, look what we've got. All of our comp... Uh, our things, like, stay. I'm gonna use this. Him with full health. And him with full... Because I used him. Him. Right, so I'm trying a new guy and the scorpion. Come on, then. Oh, he's a beast. Oh, that, that's who he is. The Priest of Tribulation. Okay, so I need someone that does big damage for cheap. Th he's only got one attack. Three to four, 65 percent. He shit him, like. Two for three to six. Two to seven for four. But it's got a 100 percent hit rate. I'm going to use this guy. To use this. Three to six. Is that called the Pimp Hand Cannon? Did you avoid that? No, no, you didn't. You didn't. Boomstick Blunderbuss. That's still the cheapest to use. And a one turn cooldown. Every skill has got a one turn cooldown. Oh, you blocked it like a dick. Got him. Four damage, it did maximum damage. Ten damage, is this guy fucking taking a piss? I need to get the most damage out of this as possible. Yeah, baby. Feel the pain. Four damage. Good, good, good. We 
block it. Hit someone else. Good. Because he can just tank the hits. Oh, I blocked it. Oh, no, he didn't. It done nine damage. It done nine damage. That is a joke. Just keep whittling him down. He's going to succumb to the pain eventually, like. Yeah, suck my balls, bitch. He's only got two health. He's dead. What's he done? What the fuck? Did he... Did he win? Did he... Did he just use the win button? Oh, but I can continue. Let's do it. You're dead, mate. How much? He's got two health. That's guaranteed to do three to four. And a 65% chance to hit. I need a 100% chance to hit. 82. I'm going to use this. Come on, hit him. You're dead. Suck us off, mate. Is that it? Did you see that? I have crushed. I've crushed my opponent. Confirm that is correct. Awesome. I did it. So now that means I've got access. I've got access to the upper floors. Come on then. I don't know what that guy just, just whipped out the nuke. He 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 was like, oh, I'm getting beat. He whip out the the win button. Who disturbs the priest of? Oh, it's you. You are the souls who buried Umalar in his own mud and dirt. Thank you for granting us some quiet from his incessant ramblings. <laughs> You're next. You're thanking me. Who's thanking me for killing your brother? Killing? No. For a priest of tribulation, there is no death. As we speak, his body is being tended in the undying catacombs of Babel. Huh? A new body is being knit together by the thousand fingered hands of the spinster. Soon he will be back with us. No doubt, warning us with tales of how he almost died again. So why have the arena? There's no danger to you. So you won't even put yourself on the line in the arena? There's no danger for you in there? No consequences? A god does not need to prove itself to a creature of flesh. This pool below us swims with the memories and minds of the five. We created the world, the very air you breathe, the very food in your belly. Did you though? Umalar created the mud and dirt below your feet. While I move, move the branches into the trees and comb the grass of the belt. Shaken seeded the world with metal and iron, creating weapons and armor. While Spinnacop wove veins of gold and jewels into the rock. Nevrogosis, the youngest of us all, she bathed the world in the blood of her womb and gave it life. Hmm. I think this guy's full of shit. Is that what the others believe? Is that what the others who live here believe? It is truth that is older than the Dalahan himself. Even Darus declares it so. We are the mouth of Darus, and we declare it as truth. It is convenient. Well, it's convenient. I will see your brother in the arena. You are no longer worthy of my time. <laughs> right, that's good, that. So I've got to get another token. To fight Moog.
Moog the Mug, but like I said, we've got access to the upper halls, the upper floor now. Let's have a quick look. Will he grant us entry? For I am a champion of the arena. The fighting pits, I, I can go in there, right? I'll tell you what I'm gonna do, I wanna save it here. We'll call it an episode when we come back. We're gonna go freshly into the fighting pits and see what's a crack like on there. I do need to find out how I can find the, the location of Bass for the. for the warden, the new warden location. But I don't know where I'm gonna get that since. Where is he? Since I think Adam's dead. Maybe he's not dead. Maybe he was just on the floor line in his own pile of sick. Ah, so maybe he's not dead. He's just being sick. He's wasted. Okay then. Right, we'll call it an episode day and we'll, we'll be on our merry adventure on the next one. See you there, lads.